your call. Thank you for sharing tears, tears of the Hanaran with me. As I read it, I found myself inspired to type up a few suggestions for you. I use Redding so they'd be easy to find. Feel free to use or ignore them as you wish. After all, it's your book! Exclamation point. Yours, Isaac Asimov. P.S. I enjoyed your use of backstory. We can heed the call, we can trip and fall, we can read the scroll on the garden wall, let the ashes fall upon us all. Say it's cool from a heated pool when we give a jewel to a starving fool, and if we can't be cruel, then let us take the tool and change the rules. I'm drunk, both inexcusable, but I have seen something. It's so simple. Just a dot and a line and another dot. That's it. That's all. Carl. For now. But the inevitable march of technology will not be stemmed. Two dots become four, become eight, become a million. A billion. Enough iridescent geometry to create an entire world. No, no, no. World. Countless as stars in the sky. Mountains, rivers, volcanoes, child's play. We will give birth to creatures the likes of which have never been seen. And with the merest motion, we will control them. Huh. We will become them. Naturally, none of these wonders will mean anything on their own. They will need to be infused with story. Conflict, romance, sex, violence, everything that makes the great religions great. But these stories can't simply be this, these paltry linear narratives, no. They will have to live and breathe with the world itself. I have imagined a new form of storytelling. Not a line, but a bolt of light. Coruscating and fractalizing into a thousand paths, choices upon choices, a seamless melding of the author's will and the reader's desire. I will create this new kind of storytelling. I will gift it to you here. I have seen it. I have 
glimpse through the veil of time. What the fuck are you talking about? 